Hello everyone, and my name is Kelly, and thank you so much for joining me today. So the last few weeks as I've been taking walks outside, um, I have noticed lots of wildlife. I have noticed a lot of different types of birds, and I've also noticed a lot of insects. Particularly, I've noticed some spiders around, around in our yard. So it got me thinking of something fun that we might be able to do with spiders. So today we're gonna make a fun and tasty spider snack. And these are all things that you most likely have in your house. So first of all, I'm gonna show you the ingredients that you're gonna need for this. So first thing is you might need some help with cutting some round slices of apple. So whatever type of apple you choose. And then you will also need some pretzels, the kind that are just like a stick. You will also need, I'm using some mini chocolate chips, the real little kind of chocolate chips, but you could use raisins or other decorative things that you might run across. And then you'll also need either some peanut butter, something that's gonna be sticky that you can spread on. I'm using sun butter because we have a nut allergy in my house. And so we eat a lot of sun butter or soy butter in our house. So a little bit of that as well. Okay, so then the next thing you just need like a, you could use a plastic knife or you could use just a regular, what I call a butter knife, okay? So you're gonna take one of the slices of apple and you're gonna take some of the sun butter and spread on top, just kind of evenly on the slice of apple. Kind of like you're making a peanut butter sandwich, only it's on apple slices. Okay, so I have it covered. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of my pretzel sticks and I want you to think about how many legs a spider might have. Okay, so we're gonna put eight legs. So we're gonna stick them into the soy but into the sun butter so that it sticks right in there, putting four on each side. Okay, and then I take another slice of apple, another slice of apple like this, and I'm gonna spread some more of my sun butter onto this slice. And I'm gonna stick this one on top of the legs, push down on it a little bit so that it kind of seals it. And the last step that I'm going to do, I'm going to take just a little bit of sun butter with a little circle spot. And you might have to play around with this a little bit, see what works best for you. And try putting on my eye. Okay, and here is my finished spider snack. Isn't that cute? And it'll be really delicious too and pretty healthy. Okay, so if you find other ways to adapt your spider, I welcome you to try using other ingredients if you think something else might work better. Okay, so enjoy your snack. Thank you so much for joining me today, and I hope to see you soon.